Hello, welcome back. Last time, Tangled Pipes went way better than I ever could have expected it to. Now, Central Processing Unit here. This puzzle has a little bit of a history with me. Virtual Agent Virgil, arrest you in the name of the law. Oh, I was sure we'd catch the hacker in the Central Processing Unit. So when I first did this puzzle, things went extremely super bad. Um, in a kind of weird way. And it led to some... <laughs> Consequences. My video schedule changing for That's pretty a cool time. That a hacker was able to fool you guys into thinking he was your boss. I wish I was that good. Mm. It's not cool, Virgil. <laughs> he almost killed us. That's true. Oh yeah. <laughs> anyway, um, but one benefit of that is I remember exactly how to get the starfish. It was extremely memorable. These two pieces of ice go up here in a shaft with Virgil. He can shuffle back and forth and just elevate himself out of the puzzle. I guess this will have to move to the right. How will that happen? How will of most of these things if happen? If I was a super hacker, I wouldn't use a piece of junk like the QT-150. This puzzle looks so tiny and simple. Like, how did this give me as much trouble as I know it gave me? Okay, so we got some ice shuffling to do. Um, what can I do right now? I can prop this on a crab, and that doesn't accomplish anything. Can I move it left? No. Can't even get in there. To get Guppy out, that piece has to separate from the other piece. Okay, so we need to do some icing. I just don't see how he could break in. FIN security is so tight. Maybe it was an inside job. Maybe it was a rogue FIN agent. I guess to do anything at all, be. I have to push this but over. FIN agent never realized there Whoops. was so much- Whoops! Oh, dang it. Okay. Did I miss everything? Maybe. Okay, well... <laughs> um, let's try this and see if it helps. Sometimes Virtual that does, sometimes Virgil. it doesn't. Sometimes I have to restart the entire game to get dialogue back. Okay, so I can do that. Um, it doesn't do anything. Yeah, okay. Not getting that dialogue back unless I quit out of the entire game. All right then. Okay, so if I go back in here. Virtual agent Virgil, arrest you in the name of the law. I guess I just have to uh, wait I around. Sure we catch the hacker in the central processing unit. I was gonna mess with this. Maybe I can mess with it, and then they'll say their other stuff. Then. No. Okay. So let's just figure out like what's going on here. This has to lift That's up. That's pretty cool that a hacker was able to fool you guys into thinking he was your boss. Guppy gets under it, puts it to good. the right. It's not cool, Virgil. He almost killed us. That looks oh, straightforward yeah. enough, right? Now, Guppy does have to get out of here, and how does that happen? Through this shaft. So both of us do it that way. All right, well, let's go ahead and try this. It might interrupt something. She's not saying anything about ice and the whatever. Hmm. I don't know. Okay, so Virgil's up there. I can't boost this right now. Well, I can lift him. Okay, yes, I can. Check course, it out. Of course, if I was a super hacker, I wouldn't use a piece of junk like the QT-150. So this is never moving to the right again. Better hope I can do what I need to do, then. So, if that's floated and this is floated, then this can come over. Virgil's not up there, though, so he's not on the thing, so he can't get the starfish. And also, Guppy's trapped now. I just don't see how he could break in. FIN security oh, is she so can get out. tight. Maybe it was an inside job. Virgil Maybe can't, it though. was a rogue FIN agent. It could be, but FIN agents are so busy. I don't see where anyone would find the time to forge messages. Hmm. All right. Uh, so... So, yeah, just boosting Virgil up here would be how I would get the basic solve, right? So I need to get him up above that thing. Well. Uh, mm, I hope I didn't miss that. This is some really fragile dialogue. How would I do anything else, though? I don't have a lot of options here. In fact, I have basically none, so this has to go over. I don't get a choice about that. Because Virgil can't get on Guppy here. Um, 
He can get all the way up here and crawl in the thing. I never realized there was so much ice in the FIN computers. No <laughs> wonder they keep freezing up. You already made that joke, well, but I'll allow it. Maybe it was a retired rogue FIN okay, there's that line. agent. Maybe before he retired, he left a program running that would let him sneak back into the computer system and wreak havoc. Can I get Virgil up above this somehow? Like, he clearly wants to clamber up there. Problem is, doing that sacrifices this ice. Oh, and uh, is also hard to do. I can do this, and it works, right? Oh. Hmm, yes. Going up. But now that ice is stuck. Uh, I don't have to go quite that far left. If I could have gotten Virgil on the ice some other way. Okay, so Virgil already on the ice. Maybe like... Mm -hmm. Okay, there's an opportunity. Ah, uh, too tall though. Yeah, doesn't work. So the way I know to get Virgil on that ice is to have it all the way against this wall. Short of that, I don't know a way to get Virgil on that ice. I admire the simplicity of the older central processing units. This one only has four moving parts. Mm -hmm. How hard can this puzzle possibly be? <laughs> so yeah, that ice is never moving left and it has to for me to get the starfish. All right, well, this is what the basic solve looks like. It's not, though, because then that ice is in Guppy's way. Okay. The so isn't this, is, the uh, processing unit, this is sneaky, somehow. Keep looking. What can I do differently? Virgil definitely crawls up here. And uh, let's see, so as, as long as... Hmm. Okay, idea. What if you are there? What if you're there? Nothing really happens. No, you can't fit. Like, that little bit of ice has to... Okay, hang on. So I can go here and go down, push this up, and... And push it far, farther over. This has to eventually go that far over. This looks like it should be so simple. I realized there was so much... Keep freezing up. Uh, okay. Maybe I can slot Virgil in here for a moment? No, that can't lift that much. So without his help, can do this. But that ice just goes away. So somehow before I've lifted this, Virgil has to be up here? That's a little hard to fathom. I have to get it back down, but that also doesn't look like it's going to happen, right? No, because I have to move it over. And yeah, that ice is gone. I can move it all the way over there and get Guppy out. I guess she can move it back now. Not accomplish anything. I'm going to save this state so that I can restore to the beginning of the puzzle and undo that if I want. And also if I do it that way, the dialogue won't keep repeating. Man, okay, so this problem looks... so simple, and yet... Somehow it's just not. How do I use that crab? He could hold this up, but then that would block this. Hold on, can I assemble the entire crab elevator before I do anything else? Well, no. Maybe. 
No, maybe. No. I keep looking for ways to push. Hi. Oop. Well, maybe you'll repeat yourself. Oh, you're just talking about uh, ice in the computers. Okay, hang on. Maybe I can assemble at least part of this. Yeah, okay. Um, so this is not the correct formation yet. It's kind of getting in that direction, but it's not there yet. Like, I need to f swap Virgil with this thing, and I have no idea how I'd do that. If I could do that, I'd be done, but... How would this ever move in that direction? I mean, this is clearly shaped for a crab to get over it, but maybe that's coincidence? Like, if I push this left, Virgil can't slot himself in between these two objects. That's what it seems like to me, at least. I can get him on this thing, but how do I sandwich in between? I mean, I must be trying to do the wrong thing. I admire the simplicity of the older central processing units. This one only has four moving parts. Okay, this is surprisingly tricky. Yeah, boosting Virgil up onto this wouldn't actually do anything, now that I look at it. What I want, more than anything, is a way to get him on Guppy's back so he can push that to the right. Like, I want to push these to the right. They're too close to the wall. That's never going to the right. And... I... Uh, I could get Virgil on top of it if he was up here. Yeah, that'd be real nice. I can't work with this, right? I sure don't think so. Maybe somehow this works? Let's see. Let's just watch the space carefully for Virgil insertion points. I don't think there are any. There goes all that ice. This is weird. Vertical range of these objects doesn't allow Virgil to enter from anywhere except, like, here. This is quite weird. Okay, what's the key move I'm missing? Well, I can do that. Oh, of course, okay. That's, that's the key move. Okay, I don't know how that eluded me for so long. I knew, I kept looking at that spot and thinking there's something I can do here. I was right. <laughs> I don't know why, I just couldn't see it. That's weird. All right, so that gets both of those there. Uh, I guess I was thinking, like, it was bad to move this to the right before I had something. I don't know. I, I could have just gone in there and tried it and seen that it works. Anyway, so, uh, that should be fine. So all I gotta do is get Virgil up on top of the, uh... Both of those ice blocks. Hmm, it's that simple, is it? Hmm, it's that simple. I guess he can sit up on this little shelf. That's a good spot for him. And hold down some ice. 
He won't really hold the ice down, though. Yeah, he can't move it downward. I never realized there was so mm. much ice in the FIN computers. No wonder they keep freezing up. Okay, so there's more puzzle geometry here. It's the shape I need, but not in the place I need. Because, yeah, so if he moves up, that ice floats up. and moves left, that ice floats le uh, up. And that lets him ascend. Like, I need this, but here. So, I guess one thing I really want is... Okay, here we go. This will be more productive. Will it? Yeah, it should. So he can get on that part. That's how I can move things down. I've had this before. Okay, let's do it uh, the other way. But then that's against the wall and that's no good. Hmm. Can I retrieve this? No. Maybe. Uh, with Virgil on that, I might be able to. But, well... Hmm. This doesn't seem a whole lot like it works. Okay, can I do anything cool with... this state? Uh, that ice won't float up, and this one will. Maybe that's useful. It makes Virgil fall. Uh, this is too far that direction. I can fix it. Okay. What a fascinatingly complex problem in such a small, simple-looking space. I admire the simplicity of the older central processing units. This one only has four moving parts. Okay, so check this out. Ooh, that was a cool move. Why was it so good, though? Um, I can wait a moment. And set this up to be Virgil mountable from there, maybe? Okay, wait, but... Right, okay, so that goes... I do that, I do that, you're mounted. Kinda. This is insufficient. Not finding a lot of places I can stash this safely. Well, hang on, so what if... I swap the order of these and assume that's good enough for... Continued work. See, so you'll just push that left. Is that okay at this point? Maybe? I don't know. I don't think it is. See, so yeah, main thing I need to create is a Virgil sandwich. I need him on top of this ice block when it's somewhere downward. Okay, so I can create... Okay, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go, here we go. I know what to do, sort of. Don't know how to do it, though. Not yet. Uh. Okay, yeah, so you can crawl in that situation. Uh, only because you had a fish head to push off. Right, if that were one to the left, I could set this up. This is cool. Wow, what a... What a complicated conundrum for such a simple space. I admire the simplicity. So, yeah. Virtual Agent Virgil is on the case. He is. Uh, this isn't quite what I wanted. Everything needs to still move differently. I need this to be there. I need to go right here. Boost up to exactly that spot. No. One more to the another direction. Yeah, so this puzzle, as it turns out, is all about the move of um, step up and push at the same time, kind of. Uh, I can move that like that. 
I can't move this like this, though. Well, that'll just have to be okay. I think it is. Okay, so Guppy, be there. Virgil, push that that way. Neat. This feels like progress. Can I create my Virgil sandwich? Not quite. Did I want to push this differently? Uh, could I have? It doesn't look like it. Well, okay, I can push it that way. Get on your back. And here we go. Virgil sandwich, but with this thing in the wrong place. I can pull it down, though, far enough to insert my Virgil sandwich where it needs to go, right? And the sandwich is freely movable. There we go. I control the top part of it and I can push the bottom part. It can go up and down. Wow, this is spectacular. It's a shame all my memories of this puzzle are negative ones. I'm making new positive ones. Because this is super neat. Now... That's going to all go at once. I need those things on the opposite side of each other. I think? Probably. And how do I propose that that will happen? Like this? I Oops, like, oh, yeah, you should have seen that coming. Guppy, what are you doing? <laughs> okay, cool. Um, now how do I move it horizontally? Well, okay. I can do this. And there we go! I made the Virgil car! That was involved. But yeah, knowing the end state I wanted sure did help a lot. There we go. Neat. Yeah, this was yeah. unforgettable. Yeah! Cool. Alright. And the rest is simple enough. Just... Well, maybe our computer will run better now that we've cleaned out its smokestack. Smokestack. <laughs> Alright, that was neat. Um, the bottle in the bottle, that sounds scary. Let's make this not a super nightmare marathon day. I'll be happy with that one puzzle in Starfish, and that's going to give me a jigsaw puzzle. Okay, so I'm back at 60 out of 60. No, nothing, uh, nothing dim here. Uh, there are several more Starfish still in the game, so we'll have plenty more rewards to go. Oh yeah, this is going to take me a while. Oof. Okay. <laughs> still got an opportunity for, uh, nightmare to continue here. It'll probably be fine. How stressful can a jigsaw puzzle be? Is this the final level? No, I don't think it is. Not quite sure what it is, though. Um, that's all the text I can see. Yeah, that's all the text. I mean, there's a little tiny bit of that circle halo somewhere, but yeah, you're not giving me much to work with, huh? Okay, metal grate. You are... Distinctive enough that I can assemble you. You'll be over here, probably. You'll be here, probably. Okay, so it's more like that. You're probably in the floor. That's what the perspective makes it look like. Uh, okay. Is this part of... It's not. That's something else entirely. This is part of you, though. Uh, this part? Yes. Oh, hey, there's a two there. Okay. Um, it's real hard to tell what I'm looking at. Okay, there's more grate, so there's like extremely dense parts in the background of it, like this. Foreground, foreground. Don't know what I'm looking at there. Foreground. I think this is probably totally on the bottom. Don't know where on the bottom. Let's say central-ish for now. Okay, there's like cables running off here that maybe I can follow. Okay, so lavender sort of looking background with cables running horizontally. Is it worth looking for that? I don't know that it is. I'm doing better at spotting the horizontal cables than the lavender background. 
text. I'm just going to park you up there for now and hope that's about where you go. It's plausible. Okay, let's go for brown then, since lavender is not being my friend. Hang on, that's that's almost the right color. Oh, that assembled. Okay, this is clearly part of the same track. Okay, like lavender transitioning to brown? Or like this kind of... Oh yeah, I see another part of it. That makes me feel like this is in the upper right. Just the way this perspective is. Plausible. Um, kind of just switching tasks at random here. Not entirely sure how I could do any better. Okay. So yeah, we're doing red lights now. Red lights. Oh, okay, that assembled. Cool. Uh, this is clearly lit up in red, but is it not part of that? It doesn't seem like it. Oh, it is. There we go. Nice. That looks ceiling-ish. That definitely looks ceiling-ish. This is maybe the upper left corner? I could believe that, for sure. Can I find, like, the bottom part of that computer? I'm sure it's possible. Will I? <laughs> Probably not on purpose. Okay, just looking at things that are vaguely red glowish. Okay, that worked. Got a bunch of stuff that's sort of the same color here. I'm trying to get these to connect. This is colored like the text. This probably goes up here somewhere. Mm, down here somewhere? Maybe not. So this is going to be dark with a little bit of yellow running down into the left through it. Like that, but different. Like this. Uh, but apparently not. Okay, that must be there. Uh, you go here, okay. I don't know why there was an extra H at the start of that. Uh... That's where Hugo goes. This is very dark. That doesn't look like much of anything else. There's some darkness here, not a lot. Okay. Just just kind of doing things. I'm, I'm assembling the darkness now. I don't know. Okay, that darkness assembled, that darkness assembled, that darkness assembled, here we go, okay, things are happening. Hey, that was nice! Yeah, I'm reasonably convinced this is upper right now. I want to find the piece that goes here. Let's do a scan and see if I can locate it. You clearly go down here somewhere, like over there or so. Uh, you clearly joined to this. Yeah, those joined, nice, okay. Um, right, doing a scan. I know what I'm looking for. I'm not exactly staying on task for finding it, but I, okay, that clearly connects. Those That is a diagonal connection. Uh, it doesn't go there, though. So pretty dark, just grayish with a little bit of brown in the lower right. There's not much that's that dark. Is this. Found it. Okay. Did it. Um, could I find a piece that goes here? In theory. Okay. So it's like pale brown kind of. Sort of like that. Sort of like that. That's in the right region. Um... Computers and things. Let's just put computers and things up in this corner. Oh, hang on. This is sort of reddish, but I don't know if that's actual red light or something else going on. Computers and stuff? Mmm, those connected. I just cannot tell mostly what I'm looking at. Here's some metal grate. And that's pretty great. 
Uh, okay, so you are clearly part of that, yes. Whatever that is. You connect to that somehow. You're the same color. Somehow you two are very related, but not quite that related. Okay, I found your relationship. Okay, that's nice. And I've seen this piece. It's this one. This is also part of it somewhere, somehow. But like a different perspective? Lo I'm a little worried about some of these large pieces without homes, but they have homes, right? This is where this goes, right? Oh, hang on. This might actually be... Oh, yeah. Those... Uh, this is not all the way in the upper left. This is sort of background. This one's more likely all the way in the upper left. Okay, I can do this. I can do this. Check me out. Okay, well, that's a, that's a clear diagonal connection there. Let's find a piece so that it can become official. Um... What would that piece look like, I wonder? It would have these purplish pipes in it. Okay, that connects there. There's a sprinkler or something. Uh, you connect here somehow. Yes, like that. Hmm... Pipe connection was made. This goes here. Nice. This goes here. This totally goes here, doesn't it? Yes. I'm not convinced you're in the right place. You might need to move right. But I don't really know anything for sure. Okay, yeah, so this this connects. These these two connect to each other, right like that. So don't move either of those pieces. That's where they go. Uh but where's the rest of those purple pipes? Like, what do they look like? It's hard to tell. And what's this business? Okay, it goes there. <laughs> um, what about that brown ground texture? There should be a whole lot of that. Hmm... Okay, here's some red stuff. There we go, got the connection that I wanted. Nice, okay. Are you part of this whole situation? Uh, you look like you want to be. Yeah, you do. Uh, this is brown ground stuff. Um, coming off of this side, that's foreground. This needs to move right, and it can. There we go. That's probably lower left corner. This piece, the piece that goes here, I can totally find that. It's not this. This goes... Uh, it's not that. No. This goes... Well, somewhere around there. Okay. Yeah, this is a di diagonal connection here. Um, that's a direct connection. Okay, so we got... This is in the correct place. This is in the correct place. I just don't have the in-between. So what about, like, the little lower left piece of a metal grate? Maybe this? Uh, true, but not the one specifically that I was looking for, but still, it was one. This? Yes. Okay, what about this piece? Upper left to lower right. Lavender track. You. Brown dirt. Not seeing it. It's you. I saw it. Okay, shadow. Ah, here's where the darkness is. I found it. Uh, where was the darkness? Well, here's some darkness. It's different darkness. Uh, this pipe. This goes here-ish. Mm -hmm. What are you? What are you? Well, you're part of the darkness. Yes, part of the darkness. There we go. Okay, I have uh, corner to corner. Um, and I'm reasonably convinced you're in this corner. What's the upper leftmost corner? Is it this? Yep. Um, you look like you continue that. I think this goes down one. Or right one. 
I'm wrong. Oh, that's where that goes. Okay, no, it probably actually is here. Uh. This pipe, this is clearly part of that pipe. Yes, sure is. This is part of that beam. Yep, sure is. Darkness. You're darkness. There we go. Are you darkness? Not the right kind. Well, those connected. Okay, it went there. Many computers in here. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just moving that and it, it found its home. Are you darkness? Not the right kind. You're darkness, but again, not the... Oh, you were the right kind. Okay, it's like under desks. That's an old, like, all-in-one Mac or something. Uh, lots of computers in here. This is a cool place I would like to hang out. <laughs> I'm not so sure about that, actually. <laughs> uh, something connected. Okay, pipe piece. Pipe piece there. Lights. Top, background, that clearly goes way up here. Hmm. Clearly. Okay, it did. There. Central. You're toward the bottom. Th that piece. You'd been missing for a while. This pretty indistinct. Oh, this goes here. Found it. Um, more desks. Left side. Hard to tell what or where anything is at this point. Was it ever not? No, not really. Um, what am I looking at? Okay, there's just computers like all up on the everything here. Okay, what goes up here? It's gonna be like blurry purplish shapes looking about like that. Yep, okay, that's one. This maybe? Yes, cool. There's still some more blurry purplish shapes, a little redder right there. This distinct horizontal line is that pipe. You're blurry and purplish. Surely you go up here somewhere. Yes, you do. You're all definitely in this area. You're not, I think. It's hard to tell, though. I should have enough connections that I can just find your home. This is like all... What is that? It's hard to tell. Uh, okay, this part of this desk. This should be a distinct horizontal line. This one. No, a different horizontal line. Not this one. That goes up here somewhere. Doesn't it? Here? There. There we go. Horizontal line. Not that. Mm, too low. Okay, this is background desk, that one. Maybe there's actually something in the foreground obscuring it, or maybe I've looked at it several times and just haven't seen. Yeah, that's it. Okay. Uh, top of computer. It's not that. Not that. Not this, right? No. Okay, you. L-shape. I should find your home. That shouldn't be too impossible. Uh, it connected. I wasn't quite... No, it didn't. Something connected. Okay, you connect... Okay, this is getting weird. Uh, are you exactly here? You might be. No, you're, you're one to the right. You're, you're one to the right. There we go. Okay... Um, let's find all the two talls a home, maybe? This one is quite mysterious. What could that even correspond to? There, apparently. Okay, so central. Central background. Uh, so that's what sort of colors are in that area. You must be somewhere around here. There's no other place for you. Okay, there you are. This is still not the top of that computer. Okay, we're just going to do a piece search at this point. 
Just put stuff wherever it can go. Do I have anything larger than one by one? I don't. You must be left side. Hmm, must be. Okay, central. Central background. Yeah, I think I can see the thing in the background there. I can sort of tell what's going on in this picture now. Kinda. It's pretty far in the background. Not revealing itself. There's the top of that computer. Uh, you must be background. Yep. Is this? Yep. Okay, pipe. There's still a piece of a pipe. It's that. It's just like a computer lab. It's not just a computer lab. There's something much more going on here. But yeah, it's a computer lab with all sorts of stuff going on. Okay, neat. Uh, so that's that puzzle done. This other type of puzzle done. Next time, gonna be the bottle in the bottle, whatever that is. I'll see you then.